Hey guys, your boy Kurt Pears, and welcome back to Telltale's The Walking Dead, Season 2, Episode 2. Yes, I know what you're probably saying, but you didn't finish Episode 1. Actually, I did, because I realized I'd made a mistake after recording the uh, second part last weekend. And I realized I made a mistake, because I didn't... didn't Take into account how Lil was left in in episode one. So um, yeah. And plus, it'll all fill itself in. As you can see, I chose Pete because Nick is a douche, and I hope he is dead. But unfortunately, Pete is bit, which means he is also dead. Because it didn't work once, don't mean it can't work at all. No, you're pretty screwed. Oh, I just laid out my little stuff, Terry. What are you some fool? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just a little. Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. What's in here? Anything we can use? Give me a minute. Could probably test on Tom Car right now. Last look of their camp here. Dead, please. Oh, damn it. Who has been through all this shit yet? I guess. <coughs> Jesus. Still can't stop scaring the whole damn thing. You know when you hear something funny? Um, you won't have a say in the matter. I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. But there it is. I'm scared of people dying. Jesus, I'm scared. Everyone ends up like this. Yeah, I know. But it's gonna happen to me. Would you... Would you promise me you'd watch out for me? Stay with Kate, no matter what you do. Any 
Yeah, he's on his own. to make a break for it. I'll find us some time. Thank you, Steve. You're your friend. I let you in, right? I won't make any promises. He's probably dead. Clem, please tell me you still have that hat hacksaw. Could really come in fucking hand. Oh, whoops. I did not react quick enough. Okay, okay. Pay more attention. Got it. Run, 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 run. house looks a lot different than the one from the first episode yeah this is this is a totally different house no it is the you same right? house where's the Luke go with you where's Alvin? what happened I was out with Peyton where are they he shot Dick what what happened Walter. Nick why are you asking about Alvin and Luke Alvin went out looking for you. Told him not to go. Damn it, Leon. Clementine. Shouldn't you have given her the pistol and taken... She's upstairs. Just distract her. And don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. Okay, I'll just lock the doors, or Clem will teleport upstairs. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. Take one of me. Emma, take one of me. I shouldn't scare people like that. Sorry, I just wanted to cheer you up. Are you shitting me with the fucking camera again? Oh, wow. Are you sure? 
bedroom? Yes, let me just go downstairs and lock the fucking door before her. Are you crying? Oh, good. No, don't sit down with this dumb girl. Go downstairs and lock the doors. Relax, Clem. She says Jin have any bullets. You said you had no bullets. How would you? Wait, if she saw the person, then there's no way she mistook Carver for Luke. They don't even look alike. He, they're not. Definitely not the same height. The fact that she, he thought that was Luke at any point. Find somewhere good to hide. Oh my God! Shut up. Oh, fucking asshole. Get out of here now. Is that how you're best out? I've got a gun. A smart girl. I will do. But I'm not a bad guy, am I? I yeah, I don't know you, so get out. I ain't saying shit to you. A lot of folks in there. Hey, you can talk to me, all right? I don't want to bite you. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe my friend. A couple of farm boys, old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. I saw them. They were dead. Oh, who? Where? Down by the river the other day. He left his daughter. I'm sorry. <laughs> the river? I'm sure that's right. Are you sure? Well, no offense, but I guess that wasn't them. Because the ones I'm looking for are very tall, you know. If you say so. Now get out. No one told you you can go in there. Oh, God. Of course they have shit easy. A lot of freight for one person. But a tornado man drove me there. I don't ever do the dishes. Yeah, well, believe me, I don't either. Just passing through, or you've been here a while. Who is this person? I hope you're not one of those nuts who took me in just to give Shango a ride. What is this place? Oh, I'll keep it. <laughs> this is a real nice place. I 
very fair. You know, you're not that very polite for an old girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. This is my house. Fair point. That sounds racist, but he's right, you know. What was that? Oh god really? Oh you stupid dumb bitch. I thought you said nobody's free. I never said that. I never said there was nobody here. When did I say there was no way here? Right. You clearly saw that door close. It was like I did. So you know whatever you saw. Again, I did not say that. Putting just the easy here with a good cop just for someone to poke in the mouth, eh? Sure. Please stand aside. Well, what's this? Yeah. Like it was taken in this room. You have no idea how many people are in this room. I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. As a matter of fact, I want you to be perfectly honest. What's your point? People don't trust you. I think I've troubled you long enough. Might as well myself out. But wait, who are you? We have a link with Jane now. Where is he? We found. How did he come to get us? Here's a hint. Lock the fucking door. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. Of course we can. I can do wherever the fuck I want. Oh, this shit has still life. Told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. I knew you. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clement Hancock came. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Becca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the fucking door. He came in. He barged in before I could lock it. Why wasn't it locked anyway? You, you all went out the back door. Did he say his name? Why do you care so much? Excuse me? Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did he have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Dad. Because your dad's the nicest man I know. No, he's not gonna hurt anyone because he's useless. Not nice, right? You know these are bad people, Susie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. Now, what do you think? Seem like he'd be coming back. He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. Now you're scaring your daughter. It wasn't my fucking. Yeah. He was scouting. He got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hasn't been there. If she was, if I wasn't here, your daughter would be dead, be and because she's a stupid bitch. Who's that? Everyone, pack up. We're moving out. Alvin, wait. Who has 
to leave now, Steve, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. And what does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Oh, fucking hell. We have to find Zeke. We'll get him on the way out. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Pete is dead. Like you should be. And you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. Go fuck yourself. It's just a tough time right now with the prison. Yeah, stop bossing me around. I'm, I'm in charge here. This hasn't been easy on you, but I'm trying, Clem. No, you're not. to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that name gets his wish. I don't know. Any ideas? Clem? There. That's where we were. not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. He did this. Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. Yeah, Keaton. He's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, Lynn. said was he wanted to say goodbye to you. Oh. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You mean make sure he still doesn't come with us? No, I don't. Promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you. Ah, uh, there was no option to say fuck all of you. I want, I don't want to be he with you. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Dad. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice.
Let's cross our fingers that zombie be eight back or Z. Oh wow! Oh, five days later, huh? Yeah, we have no food, no water, or I'm pretty sure we'd all be dead. Except Clem, because main character. Duh. Well, where the fuck did she get binoculars? Must be that ski resort. I've never been to one. Second, I booked one. <laughs> One's included. Yeah, two seats back. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. Sure sounds like a good place to spend the night. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. The bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Wait, Clem's bag was clearly Not visible the there in the back. Where did she put those binoculars? Yeah, but we've got no idea who's out there. Tell them sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group in. Think splitting up the group is a good idea? I never said it was a good idea. But it's better than risking everyone at once. Yeah, we have zombie. Be he slow, make sure nobody's waiting he for us on the other side. Hey, here. Well, zombie bait dumbass has girl. We'll just turn back. Well, who is not coming time? And zombie bait. He dumbass Nick. She's what? She's just a little girl. You're not my dad, Carlos. And you are lucky you're not my brother. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. If I was as useless as her. Her in Clementine would have put a bullet in our own head in the first episode and just gotten it over with. Stay with the group. I'm fine, Lee. I don't like this. I would yeah, fuck well, Lee's mind. Like when it's dark. If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Wait, don't leave your bag with them. Hey, um, sorry about that. I could really use your eyes and right now I don't trust Nick with hiding from the truth. We're just still on edge after the car went down. It's been five days. Why would Carlos still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? What does everyone want? Even the gang. Now, what do you think they're all after? Safety? Close. But what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Food. Nope. Come on. Clem, family. Bullshit! I would be much better off without all of you. It'd be less mouths to feed. It'd be less people to slow me the fuck down. Some things are three regrets. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? It'd just be better all around. It was not that far away. You want food, ain't you? How much more? Let's take them. I like your style. Easy, too. I'll take the big one. You get yours. Wish I had more time. It should be okay. I've got the big one. Hey, here. Look, it's not like I don't know you have guts, but are you crazy? Maybe I am. Just hey, remember? Hey. Or who? Who the main character is? Go ahead. It was a good pull. You should come free. I know. We've done this before, remember? Yeah, exactly. Nice work, kid. Wow. Mm. 
no, no bonding. <laughs> and mm, this fucker is going to die like everybody else. Wait, what the hell? Where the fuck did he come from? Oh, 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 oh. oh no, not the hammer. I'm sorry. He. 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 He, I'm sorry. He. He what? Oh. Oh, you just got saved by me? Oh, thank you? I'm sorry I locked you in, in a fucking shed? Eh? You may. Eat. Leave this group. Because you're better off without us? No? None of that? Fuck off. Uh, I'm going to leave it there because this bullshit. This is, um, some, this is some bullshit. So, yeah, until well, next time, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, and subscribe if you did. And Hopefully in the next episode, Clemson will leave this group of losers and soon to be dead people well, and just be on her own like she should be. Hopefully. Until then. Uh,